Good morning. As I'm filming this, I am one, a little bit sick still. I've just gotten over the flu or still getting over the flu. Um, and number two, it is officially the first day of winter today in Australia. Jan June, oh my God, I can't even think. June 1st is winter. My brain is fuzzled. My brain doesn't work when I'm cold. Look, my eyeballs are like crying. I'm cold and my fingertips are frozen. So because I'm sick and because it's winter, the two things that I need most in the whole world right now are a warm and hearty curry. And that's kind of what I live off in winter because it's just so nice um, to have something snuggle, snuggleable. Snuggleable? Is that a word? It is now. Snuggleable. So I'm going to show you um, a curry that I'm making now. I use a crock pot like a slow cooker. So I put it on in the morning and then it's totally ready by mid-afternoon um, if I want it for lunch as well as for dinner. I'll show you where I'm at already. This is what I have so far. It's a base of green beans and broccolini. And then I've added sweet potato and onion. And then we come over here and I've got a whole cauliflower. Yes, I am using the whole cauliflower because I love cauliflower. I'm gonna put in some lemons, see if that adds up. Um, and normally I use raw garlic, like fresh garlic, and I can eat that off the clove. I love it so much, but I'm out and it's too cold to go to the store. So therefore, minced garlic it is. What is the pink fluff on there? What are you? Okay, so now I've added in a can of chickpeas, a can of cannellini beans, probably a cup to two cups, let's say a cup and a half of red split lentil peas. Um, out of the cauliflower, added one and a half lemons, freshly squeezed, um, and then added some green curry powder, and I'm about to add some minced garlic. You know, I would love to be more helpful to you in regards to how much stuff I use, but I never really measure. Um, that's kind of a trademark cooking thing that I adopted from my own mother. We never measure anything, which is why we suck at baking, because baking, everything has to be specific. And with cooking, all about the taste. Um, I'm gonna put in some organic black rock salt. This kind of tastes um, like egg, and it smells like egg, but it gives it a really hearty flavor. I'm gonna add in a couple of bay leaves. The key with these is to count how many you put in so that you can count them on the way out because you don't want to eat these. They simply go in for flavor. Dried oregano or oregano if you're American. Dried parsley. We got some smoked paprika. Secret is nutmeg. Yeah, it makes it taste really earthy but kind of sweet. Ground cumin seeds and the, la the rest of the curry korma that I have. Okay, and now I've added all the spices um, as well as the salt and the bay leaves and now I've covered it in two cans of coconut cream, full fat, and I think I'm going to add in another can of chickpeas. And then, now I figure out how to smush it all down, mix it up, put in a little bit of water at the bottom, and then I put it on the heat. So wish me luck in mixing this because it is so full. Whoa! If this isn't a hearty curry, I don't know what is. This is five liters right here. I can do some squats with this. Yes, over the head weight lifts. No, I should, probably shouldn't do that in case I drop it. And I put it in my slow cooker for about four to eight hours. Um, since it's just veggies, it's ready pretty soon, but um, leaving it in there extra long kind of just What's the word? It massages in the flavors. It marinates. A different M word, not massages, marinates. I think I do have to go out and get an avocado though because eating this with avocado is so good and I don't have one. Although, you know what? I am planning on going up to mom and dad's place today to say hi to the dog, so maybe I can steal one of theirs. Boom, high heat. Lid on, and then I'll see you in like four to eight hours. Okie dokie, artichokey. So I've been out all morning, um, hanging out with friends, had the best morning ever, actually. It was really fun. And by morning, I mean it's like, what time is it right now? It is currently 2.41 p.m. Time flies when you're having fun. Bum, bum, bum. So this is what I mean by how good, 
Oh yeah, by how good slow cookers are. Because you literally just leave it in there all day when you're not home and it does all the magic for you. Oh, that looks so bomb. Yes. Oh, so good. So now I can turn this to low if I want to keep it warm or just fully off. And then serve this up. I'm going to cook some rice, I think, and serve it with the rice and some avocado. Oh, damn. Doesn't that look so good? This, my friends, right here is how you make a warming winter vegan plant-based curry. Doesn't that look so good? And if you give it a go, tag us in a photo of it so I can see how you went. Enjoy. Mwah.